Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I've been playing some Dragon Age Origins. We are back in the party camp just before we go into the deep roads, just so I can offload some stuffs. Let's see here. And finally give Ogren all of the ale I've been collecting. Or Zogren. Yes, I've decided I'm going to give Ogren the gifts from here, and then I'm going to pull some feast day gift stuff, hopefully in preparation for the actually I'm gonna be right back I'm gonna look that up hey everyone sorry about that just had to do a little bit of uh <coughs> looking up so what I'm planning to do is we're going to keep Augurin's gifts in my inventory for the next campaign when I eventually do Dragon Age Awakening that is because there is a glitch in reference to his um, his gifts that makes it so they all have diminishing returns and it resets his approval to zero when you play Awakening. So we're going to keep his gifts to offset that glitch. Also means I'm going. it's going to be the only time hopefully I'm going to dip into the Feast Day Gifts DLC that I have to grab some of Ogren's gifts from there so I can actually get his approval up using gifts in this game. You'll all see what I'm meeting in a minute, but... Besides that, let's make some people happy. Let's see here. Liliana. There we go. You want this. Oh, how dear of you. Thank you so much. That sounded kind of derpy. Um, gemmed bracelet. I have no idea where... Joining Charles, I know who that goes to. But... We've got three gifts for Alistair, but he's already at 100 goddamn percent. Unexpected. Thank you. Of course. Um, Dion Morrigan, I have a present for you. Please don't help me, kill me. What have you there? A mirror? It is... just the same as the mirror which Flemeth smashed on the ground so yep, long ago. Yep, and I wanted to give it, it to you because I'm nice. It is incredible you found one so like it. I am uncertain what to say. You must wish Thank something you. in return, certainly. No! Um, don't be ridiculous. It's a gift, Morgan. You say that as if I should be accustomed to such a thing. I have. She is not never accustomed to it. A gift, not Aww. one which did not come at a price. I suppose. Well, I'm giving I you one. Say thank you for the gift. It is most thoughtful. Truly. Aww, Morgan loves me now. Massive magic. <laughs> Too bad I don't fucking use her. Okay. Anybody else? Where the hell does the gold amulet go to? Well, I know that all of these go to Ogren, but uh Silver Demon Head Ring. I'm going to guess that goes to Morgan as well. She's at 100 percent though, so it doesn't fucking matter. Yeah, she doesn't care. Um Let's try... Well, we need to give something to Zevran, because we pissed him right off. Have some earrings? How nice. Okay, he didn't like those. Have a gemmed bracelet. How nice. Okay, he didn't like that either. Whoops. Okay, and the rest of these, except the gold amulet. Is that for Lily? I'm probably fucking this up, but I don't care much. Lily! Why, thank you so much. Yeah, she didn't like that. Okay, never mind. And <laughs> so let's talk to some peepsies. Oh. Hi, Shale. Shale has nothing to say. Shale never has anything to say. Hi, Alistair. Got anything to say? Something you need, my dear. You have nothing to say. Zevran. What say you? You have nothing to say. I'm trying to see if I have, have any scenes to trigger. So, you and I. Oh, hi, Liliana! Yeah. You and Alistair. Together, looking contented. You even have a glow about you. So am I pregnant? Shameless. Oh, God, am I pregnant? <laughs> so shameless. Um. He does make me very happy, so, yes. How is Alistair? Oh my god, you're seriously asking me this, Liliana. It looks fine to me. You know what I mean. No doubt. Alistair and you, those no long doubt. nights, 
he must be quite delightful. You wouldn't nope. be so happy otherwise. I can't say anything. anything. Lips are sealed. He's athletic. That's always nice. He is also good at following instructions, isn't he? Oh my god. I'm very happy with this person. He's not getting too excited to listen. Yeah, sometimes he has brilliant ideas of his own. So, Liliana. Yes. Ooh, fascinating. The little Templar is all grown up and apparently he... <clears throat> plays well with others. You must keep me updated on any new developments. Oh my god. <laughs> really, Liliana? Okay. Stop Talk to wasting Arden. time, Warden. I'm not here to chat. Oh, fine. Ogren won't actually talk to us until he freaking Ah, fine. What's until I actually mind? go and finish the uh, deep road stuffs. I get nothing. No you have nothing to say. You are useless to me. Sten. You called. I have not called. Go As away. You, wish. you look like you're wearing Caitlyn's armor, but you're not. Because. <laughs> Alistair is currently wearing Kaelin's armor. Hi, Morgan. You're still sitting here away from everybody I else. I your command. She really likes me. Yay! I am liked. Yay! Yay, 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 yay. Okay, well, that's it here. Um, oh, right. We still have to go to the circle. We have a circle of a major to go to. Yes. All right. Let's take our peeps. Yes. Yes. Come on, guys. Let's go. And we're going to go to the Circle of Magi, because I have people to talk to there. And I'm probably going to get stabbed in the face on the way there. Because that's how it usually goes, right? Get stabbed in the face. Stabbed in the face. Stabbed in the face. Stabbed to stab, 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 stabbed in the face. Oh, or not. Hi, Irving. I have to talk to you. Welcome back, friend. You'll be glad to learn um, that the circle is well on its way to recovery. Yay! Dagnov, Orzmar wishes to study Orzmar. magic. Indeed. Yes. <laughs> you have piqued my curiosity. It is common knowledge that dwarves lack the aptitude for spellcraft. She will never be able to weave the simplest magic. No matter how hard she tries. Ah. Um. All she wants is to study the theory of magic. Fascinating. I suppose the circle should be flattered. Now you don't say. She's willing to give up cast and clan for this. I see. If she is willing to sacrifice so much for this, then we should feel honored. Tell Dad. Damn straight, you should. Orzimar, that this path will not be easy. But if she chooses it, then she is welcome here at the circle. Damn straight she, she is. Live Let's go get a study dwarf. with the tranquil, and perhaps the apprentices, when it is appropriate. Awesome. Thank you, First Enchanter. Ah, if only the circle was in Irving is awesome. Shape. I fear she may be disappointed when she arrives. Well, she can help. Um... He'll have an extra pair of hands to help rebuild. This and she's a dwarf. They're good at that. Interesting. <laughs> she could tell us much about our dwarven neighbors. Yes. The more I think about it, the more I like the idea. I shall take this as an indication that perhaps things are starting to look up for the circle. <laughs> Yay for the circle. Thank you. Yeah, let's go. Um, forgive me. I must I take my leave. I wish you well. No Bye, Irving. Always You're awesome. Welcome here. Damn straight I will. Let's go, Wynn. Wynn has nothing to say to her boss. Um. Orzammar. Because we have to go talk to Dagna. Oh, Dagna, I need to talk to you. Hello, how can I- Hi. Oh, please tell me what they said. Um. So when you go to Circle, you can go to Circle and live alongside the Tranquil. First Enchanter Irving accepted you for study. Ancestors, bless you. I can't believe it. There hasn't even been a Dwarven Observer in the Circle since your Reldon in the 13th century. Uh, I, I, I need 13th to 13th century? What century are you in now? My would get suspicious. I need to go. Is there anything I should bring? Books? Tuition? Tuition? Tuition! 
Um, nothing. The mages need every ally they can get. Then I should go before my parents come looking for me. If you ever go to the circle again, maybe I'll see you there. We should go to the circle to see her. That'd be nice. But we have more, uh, complicated things to get to. We have to go into the deep rows. <coughs> Cough. I find it funny that Brunk has been gone for two years, yet in the space of, you know, a couple days, I'm able to find her. Like, you're able to find her, technically. And you're able to get through the entirety of the deep roads in a couple days. Not too, um, realistic, that. Then again, maybe it's because we have two Grey Wardens and we know how to get around things better. Caradin's Cross. Ah, <sighs> menomenomena. Area unlocked, Caradin's Cross. Hi! Hired goon? Well, look what we have here. Some of Balin's new toadies. There, Haramon's- Your That's hands have morphed king. into each other? Sure! Alistair is king, duh. Let's get started. Hi, mage. Stab you now. Right. That's a resilient mage! You know what you deserve? Crippling! And this should be easy. Punisher! Straight. Bye, mage. I'm gonna kill you now. Or you can heal yourself. Yeah, jerk. Bye-bye. And now we kill the hired king, right? Oh, hi, Alistair. Freaking heal yourself, silly boy. <laughs> well, I hope not wincing as you have most of your health and good on you, you way. That was a hell of a hit. Okay, let's loot this. Ooh, I got my health gold just back. Cool. I'm gonna loot him, get a gold ring. I'm gonna loot that higher goon. And get a thing I'm going to sell. I saw that red arrow. Of course, anything for my favorite just mage ever. It seems Favoritist you mage and ever. our fearless leader are inseparable oh, no. these days. Joined at the hip, almost. That's a bit of an overstatement, don't you think? A bit no. of an overstatement. No, no we are joined at the relationship. hip. You should learn about where babies really come from. Oh, oh. God damn it! <laughs> I know <laughs> the chance says you dream <laughs> about your babies, and the good fade spirits take them out of the fade and leave them in your arms. Oh god That's damn it! Not true. Actually, <laughs> what happens is that when a girl and a boy really love each other. Andraste's flaming sword, I know where babies come from. <laughs> Do you? Do you really? Yes. I sir. certainly hope so. Oh, all right then. Oh, look, you're all red and mottled. How cute. You did that on purpose. <laughs> now, Alistair, why would I do such a thing? Because to make fun of him? That yeah, frail yeah. old lady act. I'm so not fooled. I'm on to you now. I'm on to you now. <laughs> Wynn is amazing. Don't make fun of her. Wynn is beautiful and amazing in every single conceivable and possible way. There's dark spawn. There's a fractured stone. I'm gonna take that frost rock. I need some life stone. Dark spawn. Hello, monsters. Hello, monsters. I'm going to stab you in the butt. This should be enough. Or in the face, so I'll just add the intestinal. Excellent! I wonder if female and male, like Genlocks and Rolocks, look the same. Because you never see any definably female dark spawn except for the brood. Hello, Herlock. You had it coming. On it. Stab. As you wish. Stab. Stab. Did I seriously not trigger? Oh, damn it, shit! He'll you trigger the next fight. Uh, silly boy. Girl. Shell is female, Scarlet. Don't be silly. Oh, I've got hiccups now. 
Attack of the hiccups! No! Must get rid of the hiccups! You guys can't really hear it, but I'm hiccuping. Uh, quite a lot, actually. It's a bad thing to happen to try to let's play. Oh well, kill the gen lock. Ventilate the dark spawn. Probably. There is a lot of dark spawn here. Doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo. There's a mage stun. Excellent. I'ma stab you in the butt. Damn it! Fine, I'll stab you in the testicles. God, I'm gonna die. Let's get started. Let's not. Yay, we killed the mage. Move and parry. Strike and kill. That is indeed how you usually kill things. Okay, I see if there's dark spawn over there, but we're not gonna go over there just yet. Wait, what? It seriously won't let me. Oh, fine. We'll go kill these guys over here. Ah, jerks. Actually, we're gonna kill these guys in the next video. <laughs> oh, there's a hiccup. My name is Miss Carla Tanager, and I've been playing some Dragon Age Origins. See you all in the next video.